one too. Send this thing out. Perfect. Let's have a look at these. Let's see what we got here. Oh, Jesus Christ, it was like a minute 30 before I started anything. Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent-pending Somnusculpt technology provides okay. some and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnusculpt will make your dreams come true. Sweet Jesus, this is going to hit me with long ass loading times. No, okay. No, that loading bar's a lie. Jesus Christ, the loading bar really was a lie. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Let's have a look. I never read the terms of service. Just do the thing. Yeah. Yeah, who bothers reading the terms of service? Okay. How many times can I do this? Oh my god. Okay, oh shit. Okay, I think I can have fun with that. <laughs> uh, okay. You know what, one more, for good measure. I don't think this can I don't think this thing can get much bigger. Oh no. Is there a jump button? Okay, so shrink's also a function. Terms of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. This is some portal shit. 
How small can you make something? Yeah, that seems to be about the limit. So far, the first puzzle down, not too bad. Ah, yeah. oh, that's interesting. So there's no. Okay. This is going to really screw with my depth perception. through. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay. I do love just the increasingly large sound effects. That's a nice little touch. Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol, and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. Thanks. I think that's always what you want to hear from... Licensed medical professionals. I don't care. <clears throat> okay. Nice and easy so far. Oh, that's weird. Thank you for letting me know about that. I wonder if there's any way that I can erase the on-air shit that's on there. Stop broadcast and press share, but yeah, well, let's see. Let's see if this just cuts it off, or if there is a way to... Yeah, I got no idea. I'm thinking just hitting that will just shut the whole thing down. It's like I could try, but, you know, the whole thing will just go... Probably wonky. Okay, come on, cheese. When in doubt, always use the cheese. Uh, a little bit more. Oh, fuck. Oh, there's too much cheese. Okay, I've, I've, oh, no. Come on. One more. But at least I can't crush myself with cheese. Jesus Christ. Come on. There we go. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. Can't argue with that logic. I do actually really like that, but that is... It's a nice little unique thing. Uh, you know what? I feel like I'm gonna want you. 
You can come with me. Warning, you have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. I could, or I could get a nice can of baking soda. Just out of curiosity, was that door even going to open? No. No, I'm not I'm not willing yet. Random soda. What even is water soda? Oh, okay. We're gonna be that way then. Alright, well you can come with me. Actually, no, there's gotta be something. Shortly. There's gotta be some way to get around that door, unless this was just an Easter egg. Hmm. Didn't this thing get so goddamn ominous come on I see you up there platform Okay, I'm just getting the can of soda. Okay, no, screw it. Let's keep going. I feel that one out. Another time. You gotta get small enough to get in there, buddy. No, nope, that wasn't it. It's all fixed. Oh, come on, you were so close. You son of a bitch. There we go. All environments perceived <clears throat> during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. Ready for the Stanley Parable. I am a god. What's next? Oh, what is next? Okay.
A lot of up and down. Uh, yeah, I can see exactly what you're telling to- fuck. I can see exactly what you're saying to me. Which can probably make your life a little bit easier. <laughs> yeah, it's weird that it's just showing up with the whole, um... That whole thing on the right there. Ah, I see what you're doing. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I think we've got the right idea, but the wrong method. Come on, we can... There we go. Just gotta get that colossal cube going on. Okay. What do you think? Left, right, forward. I wonder how big that YouTube lag is, though, overall. Because I could imagine it being pretty shocking. When is this thing going to go? Ah. Oh. Okay. Oh, wow, it's 30 second delay. That's crazy. Okay, so now we're just thinking with portals, though. So I come through this one, and then, yeah. Just portals. Alright, well, that didn't matter. <laughs> 30 second delay is nuts, though. Be great if you could just... Oh, really? Okay. What about the other one? Uh, no. Yeah, no. We gotta make a chunky sign. <laughs> How do I tilt it down into my thing? Alright. I think it opened the door in the next room. Here we go. Ah, you bastard. See, so yeah, if we go to the next room, we got nothing on this one. But, if we just plop this down over here, that looks open to me. So, we just gotta make the biggest fuck off sign possible. You know what? We can go bigger. We can go bigger. <laughs> I actually really like this, though. This is a good puzzle gimmick. Please stand by for polite recognition on your completion of the Somnasculpt orientation. You did it. To Thanks. maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. I'm not normally the type to reject authority, but that just... Eh, it's I'm just getting that vibe right now. Is there a sprint? I really have not actually bothered checking out all the buttons on this game. Not a lot. Well, there we go. What have we got in here? Yeah, so run me through what Stanley is. Have have a little have a little chat for me on that one. Well, I just, you know, start rubbing my face against walls until I can find a little thingy. Alright, come on. Aha! Cheese! 
It's always cheese. Thanks, little buddy. Alright, but I can't do that there. I wonder if I can... Alright, let's see, where would I put the cheese then? Let's have a look here. Not seeing much out of that one. Because, yeah, Stanley Parable is a thing that I've heard of before, but know very, very little about. All I've really heard is the title. Where does the cheese go? I think that's a platform. Or a button. <clears throat> okay. So you gotta make some, uh... So the narrator's just gonna screw with you, pretty much, is what I'm getting out of this. Oh god, come on cheese. You've, you've tilted the wrong direction. Oh, is there a character limit? Or is it dividing it up for you? Because I thought it was just dividing it up into ultimate, uh, ultimate, into different comments there. Can I just like... Come on, tilt the other way. Can I only do left and right? Can I do up and down? What a... oh. Okay. Oh, well, there you go. Look at that. I already know what's going on. With... oh my god, just let me tilt the cheese the right way. Alright. Bigger, bigger cheese. Oh, I'm a secret genius. I knew what I was doing. I, uh, I blocked off the doorway. Okay, what else have we got here? Okay, great. Just the one path that I've physics engined my way out of, probably. Oh, never mind. Something, something... Close a window, open a door. Is that even the saying? I think I got the saying wrong. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, well, if you can't make a big fire hydrant, what's the point? Oh well, that's good. Secret trophy. Oh, you bastard. I even just went through my own bed. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, there you go, that's... Yeah, let's, let, let's go with that, that's what I meant. Jesus Christ, hang on. Okay, no, the, the dots kept going. I thought I was meant to, like, turn and follow the dots. No, just, just a long old loading screen. I'll just sit here for a while. Yeah, I know, right? I thought that was part of a puzzle just then. But no, they just, they just kept going. Just can't move, can't do nothing. It's just letting you know that it's really loading. Like, it's going for it. Here we go. Yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, impatient, indecisive. I don't know what I want, but I know that I want it now. I know one thing I don't know. I was freaking out.
No, I know, you can only hear the voice, but you can't see just, like, the complete monkey-like behaviour. Pillows torn, thrown around all over the shop. It was... <sighs> something I'm not proud of. But here we are. Actually, that being said, if you saw that first loading screen, I think you jumped in later, so you might... That 30 second delay... I don't know. I don't know, I'm just winging it here. You're actually responding pretty quickly. So, probably not. <laughs> Oh, well. not gone through that. Okay, what's that. What have we got? Can't even punch in my timesheet. Here we go. Oh, is this going to shut off again? It's ominous, but... No? Okay. feels like a big drink kind of day. Alright, you'll do. Let's go, buddy. kind of thing you're saying you're a genius this is why I need you for these things can I like battering ram it open oh no I've made it smaller uh, I did a bad All right, what about just like there you go that's another alternative Alright, I don't think I'm going to be able to open that one, though. Yeah, no, just as an alternative, just pick it up and just kind of plop it down, and there you go. Just kind of do that. There you go. Chunky can. See, look at that. Learning already. Alright, no one's leaving this room until I figure out what's going on. God, hotel art's so bad. See what's down here. Oh god. Okay, well played. Where's a crouch button? Oh. Can I just get like a Alright, come on, you're with me right now. Wait, why am I doing this with a can? The door. I should have done this when I picked it up. I don't think this is going to work anymore because I can only rotate on one axis for some reason. Maybe let's 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 prop you up there. Ah, oh, you bastard. Okay, we're just making this door too small. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I don't know why I'm convinced this will do something. Come on, turn for me. Ah, I give up. Alright. I'm just gonna start pulling all of these. One of them's gotta do something eventually. Well, 
me now. <laughs> I'll read that note in a moment. Hallway back. That's a good idea. I just want to try to see if I can put this door on there. Okay, no. Nah, that'll do. So, this way or the other way? Nah, it looks like it's still going to do it regardless. That was a good idea, though. I like that one. Alright, what do we got here? I kind of wish I could put that in buildings. <laughs> this thing is really going to start fucking with me. Thank you, game. It's like uh, those paintings across, you know, it goes out 15 meters. Actually, we have a couple of them on the highways around here. Ah, oh, you bastard. Ah, oh, I don't like that. Alright. Okay, I can pick that up. Oh god, I thought that was actually a thing. Because game design, they could have just done bump mapping for some of these things, and then just actual polygons for some of the others. I don't know if that would have been a nightmare to make, or really fun. Alright. Oh, hang on. Here we go. Oh god. Oh god. Trying to make a ramp here. That'll do. I kind of want to get up there. Hmm. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. I really need like a zoom in or a something else function. Looks like I've only really got the two buttons. Seriously, got any examples for that one? Because that's kind of interesting. Really expected there to be something up here. Okay. I might have to look into that at some point. Let's just put you down there. Alright, what if... Aha! Oh. Christ, my character can move like a mountain goat. Alright. Right about there. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't really have a plan. I'm not entirely- like, I know I meant to go that way, but... Okay, that's just a wall. Alright, yeah, no, never mind. Let's have a look around the side. <laughs> just a one keyboard note. Boom. Oh, I can still just take these, though. Be quiet, baby. Is he even in the room, or is he...? He's in the room. He's inside. Okay. Hello! 
My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk to you about being special. So special, in fact, that we have no idea where you are. But not to worry, we're working on it. Stop sounding so sad, you've had your food. It's, it's okay. Please. <laughs> oh no, it's never gonna stop. BB, please. Please. Go into the other room and cry there. <laughs> oh boy. Alright. <laughs> Let's have a look. Uh, and instead of following your instructions there, the cat has been locked out of the room. Okay, I'll see if the go here is, but before I do that, I want to see if there's anything else around. I get what you're doing, but not yet. I told you, he's he's, he's loud. He's non-stop. Hey! find something for it. <laughs> Alright, let's see if there's something to hold up for it. Oh no, it's just the exit. There's a lot of these though. So... Oh, okay, I see. The Q Bob, that's a good idea. Can't believe I didn't think of that. Alright, let's make you small. How does that work though? Oh, hang on. It's there. It's this bit. We can use both cubes though. That's probably what I meant to do. I meant to make this. It's like a... Oh, you're so close. Because we got this one with these lines. I feel like that's part of it. But nothing's... Get my way table. Oh, I see. How's that? Come on. Make another table. There we go. And now I can get the viewpoint. Not quite with the cube. Whoops. Because I can't rotate it right. Oh, wait, the flower's it. There we go. And now you come here. Well, ah, oh, stairs. I was going to say, I guess I didn't really need it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Baby, come here. Come here. Nah, he's just gonna sit in the corner and scream. Come, come here, buddy. Oh, I'm so gonna turn him into food. Yeah, 
so I probably need to be up there. Oh, hey, now we can get the cube, the one that you talked about before. Oh my god, I suck. Worst case scenario, I'll just do that one again. But where do we put the cube? Here it is. <laughs> yeah, it might be a little too big. There we go. Taped a tour there. What if there's anything on the other side, just out of curiosity? Probably not, but uh, I gotta find out. Nah, pretty bare bones. to be like the inner workings of my mind where no one's really paying attention. No, oh, no, I guess that's sleep therapy. It's just build in the back alley sleep janitor's house. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'm just popping in to give you a quick update on where you are. We still don't know, but please keep moving forward and hopefully you prefer frequent updates to being reminded that you are completely lost. Man, getting lost in a dream. This is some uh, Inception stuff going on right now. That being said, if you got these powers, play with them, enjoy them. Uh, hang on a second. The, oh wait, the poster down here. So it's got that dissection. Uh, this one here. Are you lucid dreaming? Please head to the exit to wake up. I'm assuming this was the poster you meant. I'll sit here for a little bit and wait for your reply to make sure. Just in case. Oh, too tall. Yeah, I got you fam. Just reminded. Uh... Oh, right, yeah. Um, I don't know how my internet's gonna go with this whole thing, so I honestly just went with, like, 720p standard, um, to start with. Uh, you know, I told you we've got all the high winds and it might get knocked out anyway, and my internet is probably garbage. I can try up for higher on next time. If there's another thing. God, that's a weird-looking clock. Can I get back far enough? Come on. You're mine. Can't help myself with what? <laughs> it's it's not right okay you you don't divide a square I'm going back over this clock I'm gonna have a little little moment with this goddamn clock like who, who makes a square clock why is it that's that's not right you got what's that three at the top there one on each side three at the bottom nah that's nah that's not how you do a clock that's not right a clock is a circle I'm, I'm judging it because it's stupid like, look at that. 3535. Three, now. Nah. nah. I don't like it. Stupid ass clock. Ah. That might come in handy. 
And I'm telling you, that freaking... The, the platypus is stupid. I love it. It's a great little animal. But it's stupid. Ah, oh, I... And I'm stupid. I just walked straight off a little thing. Okay. Give me the money. Huh. Oh, ha -ha. I see you. How do we do this? Is there anything else I can pick up to use as like a ladder? Right, we put that over there. Oh god, no, no, it's okay, it's okay. Need a third thing. Because I want to get up there. If for nothing else, just to pull that fire alarm. I've got a trend going now. Can I get on top of you? Alright, what if I bring you down? Go from one to the other. Nope, you can't jump on that one. Come on, I'm going to get you. <laughs> How do I get up there? I'm sure there's a way up there. There's got to be. Let's have a look around. Well, that ain't it. So I don't want to go out there and lose this opportunity. <laughs> I'm worried. Alright, just in case. Uh, okay. Why does this feel like it's going to be a false perspective? Okay, no items through that point, so I can't take items. Which means if there are other items here, like the dumpster. No. Come on, there's gotta be something. Can I drive a forklift? Have I got a license? No, nope, no idea what I'm doing. Because I want to get up there. The sign. The sign. She's a genius. I can't believe I forgot about the sign. Oh, I can't take this one. It was a good idea, but the game says no. It's like I'm convinced I got to use this as like some kind of. I don't even know if I can stand on this. I can. So, I make the block. Oh, the little door. Wait, to the right of the main door. This one? What are we talking about? There's a little door over here. There is so a little door. No, no little door option. You know what, I've got two objects. I think that'd be enough. I just gotta like enlarge them one at a time. Jump on one, enlarge the other. Jump on the other, enlarge one. And just follow that trend there. Gotta like step ladder my way up. Eh, eh. So if we get this. Like that. About there. Yeah, a little bit more. Okay. On to this. On to this. Actually, I think I'm already done. <laughs> hey! 
Oh. Oh, okay. It's just a secret. We weren't meant to get here. Mm. Is there, like, anything else up here? Nothing at all. I'll take it, though. I've, I've had my minor victory. I got a trophy. That's all I needed. Oh, we're back here where I was making the big old signs. See, I would have liked more than just like a little trophy. Like, yeah, a, a little special dialogue line. Even just as something as simple as a, how did you do this? We didn't know this was a thing. You know, something. Something small, just a little acknowledgement. It would be nice. Or get out from there, you complete idiot. This is not the way you're meant to be going. Let's see what Glenn has for us. Well, oh, wrong button. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and we still can't find you. But you should now have access to a series of elevators that should trigger your subconscious to gradually wake you up. You should also find a variety of emergency exit signs that should lead you to them. Will all of this work? Absolutely. At least he's confident. Can I take these signs back? I totally can. Ah, uh, it won't let me do a thing though. This was the area I was looking at going up in though, so... Hmm. Alright. I'm gonna pull every single one of these that I find until one of them actually just starts spraying water all over the screen. Where's the part we have to shoot you, dream wife? <laughs> Just the game takes a very sudden and dark turn in one of these hallways. Aha, uh -huh, there's more of you. One of these is gonna do something, I swear to god. Ah! More and more of these. I swear, one of them's gonna do something. Hey, maybe if we're lucky we'll see someone, you know, eyes explode or something. Okay, what are we doing in here then? Okay, that looks like the way out. Because I don't see any, uh, what's it called? What are the signs? The exit signs, that's the word I was looking for. Alrighty. Okay, I just found all your pictures of square clocks, and I don't care how many of them there are, that doesn't make them right. That's a, that's a bandwagon fallacy right there, I, I expected more of you. You can have as many square clocks as you want, it's still wrong. Where in the holy hell? Clock. Can I take the clock? Can I take anything out of this room? Is there a perspective thing I'm missing? I can't argue with you on that one. <laughs> and I'm really mad about it. <laughs> you can just fit more wrongness into a shipping container. There's got to be some perspective thing here, because that pillar does not touch it. Like, those two pillars don't touch anything. Maybe... 
Can't go too far back though. Is there anything in here? Okay, if I can actually grab the moon, I'm gonna be really upset. Oh my god, are you serious? Uh, there was something on the moon. There's a can of corn. There's a soda can on the moon. Smooth diet soda on the moon. One of the last things that. What else is here? Ah, here we go. Like, really, it was... What are all these things on the moon? Couple of letters, Chinese rover. Cheese. Cheese, come on, it had to be cheese. Of course it was cheese. Oh, My there's a radio. Name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In the event that this elevator does not wake you up, please don't interact with anything that strikes you as psychologically significant, as we will no longer have any way of controlling it. For example, if you see your parents, please punch them in the face as hard as you can and immediately run away. Or shoot your space wife. It's possible to climb out of that. I think we can probably climb out of there. So if we set up big old chunky block. like that. Okay, we're gonna need, gonna need a little bit of help from the cheese. That's actually, no, it's better off maybe getting the cheese back, because this is still pretty big. God, don't fall off. No cheese! Oh, I've messed it all up. Alright, come on, come on. We're getting out of here. So close. Jeez. All right. Can I? Eh. No, nope, not quite. Eh. Son of a bitch. Huh. Oh, there's stuff up there though. I can work with this. I can work with this. 
maybe. How did I get up here before? There we go. This is gonna make like a really small. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright, I think we're going to have to push the whole thing back. Stay there, Chungus Cheese. Alright, we're going to go a little bit further with you. A little bit more. Bastard. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. This is happening. Okay. Cheese. I need to wedge you. No. This is, this is a balancing act now. Go, go, go. Ah, oh, you bastard. <laughs> Maybe the can. Maybe if I can get the can upright somehow. I have no idea how this is going to work. To the point where I don't think it will. Alright. You know, you might be right, and I might be able to. But at this stage, I'm kind of dedicated to doing it this way. I guess I'll try it your way. This, this, this ain't going to happen. Alright, just cheese it is. Get, get out of my way. Okay, close. Big, 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 big. Big cheese. Close. Big, big, big. I think I've done too much cheese. just put the block on here though. Shut up, I can hear you judging me through your silence. Can I like, knock that out or something? You know what? That would have been a much better idea. I should have done that. <laughs> hey! Oh? Oh, wow. That's... Alright. Let's turn them all off. Oh, it does turn them all off. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> By the end of it, this was nothing. It's kind of cool, though. I do like the, uh... Yeah, 
Yeah, well done. But now, they're not even giving me a trophy for this little thing. Like, man, what do you, what do you guys need from me? No acknowledgement whatsoever. Alrighty, well, I guess we've done that. Stay there, cheese. You know what? No, you come with me, cheese. You've been very useful. Okay. Don't meet sister-in-law. Three to five dreams per night. Yeah, we've got a beer fund of five dollars in Dakota. Okay. Don't meet the sister-in-law. That means if there's a sister-in-law, there probably is a wife. And you might be right, we might have to shoot wife. We might go total recall. You might have just called, like, the plot twist right there at the end. Help me, Liam. Oh man, I forgot fear was a thing. Um, yeah, yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about. Don't remember the name, but yeah, Jesus, I've not played fear for a long time. There it is. Yeah, this game's just going to take like a sudden, dark, horrifying turn. It has to. That's the only way it's going to go. These goddamn loading screens. Oh, never mind. Oh, God. I think I said 3 a.m. before, now it's saying 4 a.m. Average person has 3 to 5 dreams a night. That's probably like a little foreshadowing that I'm gonna wake up in this room a few more times. Wait, it said sweet F before. Yeah, still sweet F. Yeah, that's all the same. Yeah, still private. Punch it in, you goddamn ass square clocks. They belong in a shipping container and nowhere else. Is it like, oh wow, look, mini soda. Even minier. Alma! That was the name. I prefer Susie. Can I push it? I don't know why the hell... Uh, what's it say about the mini soda? There. The North Star drink. Uh, on YouTube, I'm pretty sure it's a kangaroo. If I had to take a guess. Wait, is this thing saying that I'm testing Roblox? The fuck? <laughs> Alright, what up? This is an automated message for all patients who attempted to use an alternate pathway to access the next phase of Somnasculpt therapy, but who have become trapped in a dream state paradox instead. Your decisions imply a failure of orientation, which reflects negatively on the standard orientation protocol. You will rectify this failure immediately. 
Jesus, she's aggressive. All right. Something else here, just tell me to use dice. I think I can be classified as a curator, right? See, this is how a clock's meant to be. Okay, well, not so much. It hasn't got numbers, but it's it's, it's closer. It's getting there. I'm in the D6, you think? Oh, speaking of. Actually, hang on. Were these any significance? I don't know. Three five, three five. Maybe I'm just starting to look into numerology a little bit. Has that fallen over before? Yeah, these ones here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's find out. Six rooms, six puzzles, huh? sign. No. Nope, oh, too big. Oh, well, here we go. Oh, you... It's like when everything turns out to be a cake. soda cup or oh, one in this room hmm I may have made it too big whoops <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> oh, good lord! Okay. Um. Okay. I'm just gonna... Yeah, that happened. Let's just try that again. <laughs> Shut up. I'm taking no responsibility for that one. <laughs> Shut up. Bethesda game right there. Just ragdolling uncontrollably. Alright, let's try this again. There we go, that ain't so bad. Alright, you come with me. You come with me. Sure I'll have a purpose for you soon. Nope. Okay, you stay there. Oh, again, all kinds of useful tools right now. Bathosphere? Bethsta. I don't know what you're talking about. What's wrong with Bethsta? Or Bethesda, I suppose. Bethesda. So you, you just gotta let me slow my words together. It's the only way I feel comfortable.
It's just what we do, okay? It's an Australian thing. Just, just, just let it be. Just let it be. Don't judge me too harshly for it. I'm surprised that's the first thing you've called me up on about for speech. <laughs> It's like, out of all the things to call me up, I, don't know, I didn't think Bethesda would be one of them. Professional tip, the average adult can only withstand three to five dreams per night. Once this threshold is eclipsed by entering more dreams, your mind will suffer an explosive mental overload, reorienting you for the emergency exit protocol. Please subject yourself to explosive mental overload. You know, if anyone says expose yourself to explosive mental overload, I think that's a sign that, like, no. Like, nothing about that sounds good. That's kind of where I draw the line. I think we're going to need another can of mini soda to get us through this. I've heard about it before, yeah, like, uh, shit, sorry, you had to go through that, though, that would have been, like, I've, I've heard it's absolutely atrocious, uh, for lack of a better word. Oh, good lord. I just wanted to read what it said on the baking soda can. Oh, just what she said in the thing, uh... Yeah, th something like that, I think it's... What, I don't know, what, what the hell was it? The exploding head syndrome. Ex explain it to me, make sure I'm thinking of the same thing. Oh, no, that thing! Yes, okay, yeah. Yeah, no, I was thinking of bad migraines for her, though. But yes, no, okay, I know what you're talking about. Ugh, dicks. I need, yeah, I was wondering where all these were. I'm not considered an employee in my own dreams. Okay, now we're good. Like, out of all the places to be considered an employee, you think that'd be one of them. <laughs> well, you know we go on for this. Oh. What? Oh, what? Okay. Interesting. Okay, this is not what I expected to go on here. It's like, there's your easy way out, but... Where's the fun in that? What could be... The purpose for the rest of that, if any. Not only there's a place to go or whatever, but I see zero reason for anything else in this. Unless I can. No. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave this one. Unless there's something you can see from it that's worth investigating, because I see nothing here.
No, no I'm just going to chase it out. Oh. Please note that a reluctance to volunteer for the risks associated with explosive mental overload implies a misunderstanding of all other solutions, all of which are far more traumatic and likelier to result in catastrophe. I am not capable of suboptimal suggestions. Please exit this dream as soon as possible. Hmm. I, I know what you mean. I don't think there's anything there. Maybe there is, but... I don't, it's this bear. Okay. Yep, yeah, no. That's, that's just annoying. There we go. I'm so great. Oh, fuck off. Okay. All right, where am I taking this one first? Something, something elevators. So, alright, we got a while to go. Dream layers of the mind. People only dream of ordinary objects, which is boring. These are the testers so far. I know who Bart Bragan is. My money's on Jojo Smith, just for the name Jojo. But just out of kind of curiosity, I want to see what's. if I bother going up, if I can. No, I can't go up. I can't, never mind. Did I pull this? Yeah, it's just back in that first room. This is where we came out and looked like the dice. You need the fire alarms. The fire alarms is just... I'm, I'm convinced one of them will do something. <laughs> I, I, I swear I probably already missed one or two of them. Oh, wow. No, I've got them all. Jesus Christ. Oh, really? That's disappointing. Where was it? Do you remember? Oh, that's annoying. Alright, well this is 5am. Every, every time we do one of these it goes forward an hour. Maybe, maybe, uh, we'll be lucky and it will just only have pull most of the fire alarms instead of all. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you've just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. Oh. Why do I feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? Okay. Alright, what have we got here? I, I, I do love the mini soda. Okay, alrighty. Alright, well, I 
I guess we're heading towards the red light. This is the time where you start slapping yourself and, you know, begging to wake up. <laughs> yeah, no, screw that. I want out. Oh, there you go. I could just go back. Man, yeah, no. I'm really getting serious now. I think I can take Alma with my perspective powers. Just make her really small. What are you going to do about it? Oh, okay. Hey, you might have been right. <laughs> I looked away right as that happened. Didn't we say this game is going to take like a really dark turn out of nowhere? Yeah. We're just going to keep this nice and closed. Unless there's a way over it or something. Yeah, I suppose you're right on that one. Oh man, you really can't just... I guess when it's all dreams, we had to hit the nightmares sooner or later. Oh, Sunday's beans at least. Murder, 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 murder beans. Fantastic. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I guess... Oh, hang on. Jesus, how far this way can I go? Okay. Now I'm sitting out there looking for the Viet Cong. <laughs> Die it. Emergency generator. Alright, let's go fight some zombies. Ah, you sneaky little thing. I saw you. I know you're there. I don't think there's any way around it, though. Ah ha ha! Not this way. Is this the one that I came on? Which means, what about this way? How far across am I? About halfway. Ain't gonna get me demons. Eh, then again, maybe they will. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk more about the feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt I mentioned before. You feel this way because you want the kind of happy life you see all around you. The kind you know everyone else is enjoying. And that's exactly why we're here to help. Alrighty.
That's what they say about punching your parents in the face and running. No black pieces. It's racist. Unfortunately, I couldn't take any of these pawns. They're all locked into place. It was. Yeah, I saw you do that that time. Yeah, it's a lot of a, yeah, a lot of a big one. I mean, like, yeah, look, you got everything. All right, I'm just gonna have to move straight forward. Should probably like. Oh, there you go. There's another one. Uh -huh. Warning, you were advised to subject yourself to explosive mental overload by descending into additional dreams but have now descended into a dream within a dream instead, disorienting yourself even further. Oh, son of a you bitch. are responsible for failing to make this crucial distinction. I don't like the robo voice. I lost my yeah no okay I can't take those off. Is there anything I can pick up around here? Back into the walls. Come on, it's gonna be something. Where we at? Where we at? I think I'm gonna have to have a look in that other way, the way that I came again. Maybe there was something else. Yeah, then again, maybe not. Alright, back to the red room. You know, I don't see no fire alarms here. Oh god, I got stuck. So I can't take these off like I did the last time. Is there anything I can pick up anywhere in here? I haven't had to pick anything up for a while now that I think about it. It's been different kind of puzzles, so... It's been light-based. <laughs> it's alright, nothing's gonna jump out. But now you're gonna have really weird puzzles in your dreams. Like, look at that. That's that's what you're gonna have to deal with. This this right here. Okay, so I can duck into this corner, but I can't get around the thing. Like it's all light based. You gotta use the light to track your actual movement. The rest is in dark. But there's nowhere I can really walk into in this one. Seeing there's no crouch button. Just try to get under it. It's gotta be something. Oh, come on. What is it? What are you? I knew I'd get stuck eventually, but... Eh, I'm actually, you know, pretty good progress lately. So, what is the one here? Actually, it's so dark. There's gonna be so 
Oh. I can't go that way, that's just a wall. Alright, let's have a quick look out here. You know, that's all above board. What are you? That didn't do it. Maybe there is an item I can take in here. Alright, we're going to try jumping down. See what we can find. Hoppa! Can't take you. You're the arrow telling me to go that way. No, I'm not seeing any items. Ah, uh, here we go. Different room. Or is this just as far back as it'll go? Oh boy, I'm lost now. Okay. The shadow eyes? What do you mean? <clears throat> oh, like there? Like, just there at the top. Those two little lights. Yeah, no, I see you right at the top there. Yeah, I get that. Yeah, that is kind of creepy, because the way that it, like, goes out as well, it kind of looks like, just underneath, it looks like you can kind of have a body and, like, two arms looming over you. With the whole thing. Yeah, that, yeah, I didn't even notice that. But it looks like this is pretty much the end of it. I'm just rubbing my back on the wall. There's no other direction to go there. It's alright, we don't got to look at that again. <laughs> Jump over it. There's something there. Okay, so we're back here. See, when you look at it like this, it looks like a low-res Kermit the Frog face. I have no idea for this room. Like this one, this one's got me stumped. Um. <sighs> so that's what I was thinking, but I, like I've I've gone here. I'll go all the way back again, and I'll just like follow the wall, hugging it around left. I guess I didn't try jumping backwards. Maybe it could have just been like a um waist high wall. Alright, nothing, go to the right, nothing, go forward from here, alright, well I can't tell anymore, but let's go left, same deal, yeah, no, it looks like there's like nothing here, oh, hang on, I think I've just gone more backwards. I might be stuck now. I can't see anything. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I think we're... <laughs> I, I think we're stuck. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep jumping and hope for the best. I think... I can't tell any... Oh, hang on. Oh, I was there for a second. Where are you? Oh, no, we're just back here. Okay, I don't think that was, like, really... Yeah. Yep, 
You know, I think I just lost it for a moment, but there's... Nothing really there. Like, this is... Mm. And just start, like, hammering. So, for it. Sorry, give me a moment. I'm just scratching my arm. Ugh. In the, uh, did you mean the dark hallway or in the red room? This one over here? Alright. So let's go backwards. We're looking for that little white dot to turn into a hand. I'm just gonna start. Bunch of nothing, unfortunately. Um, yeah, this is this is a tough one. Hmm. This is okay. Hang on. I'm, I'm about to feel really stupid in a second. I think because what I'm gonna do, like, is there just something that I missed that I could pick up here? Like, it, oh my god, I hate myself. Okay, here we go. We got the whole room now. Alright, let's have a look around. Oh wait, now we could probably check out that hallway. Because we were jumping on things before. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, look at this. So this is what I would have been jumping up on before. And then back and forth and getting all confused. Wow, I can't believe I missed out on that red light for so long. That, that, we were there for like, what, 10, 15 minutes? I don't know, probably longer. <sighs> Give me a red soda and a baking soda. That was there for way too long. <laughs> oh. More bloodstains. Really tiny light now. Just keep that there because can't take it through here anyway. So I think we want to use it to light this whole bad boy up. There we go. Did you know that unintentional multi-dream layering occurs in less than 1% of patients? This correlates strongly with the 99% of patients who are able to follow simple Aww. instructions from the standard orientation protocol. Oh, I just threw my phone onto the ground there. Okay, so let's get back to it now that I got my stuff back. Alright. So, what I'm hearing is that it's just... What are they cutting up there? What is that? Oh. 
Here we go. If Alma's jumping out, this is where she's doing it. Ikea. Nice burrito. Yeah. Wait, so this just lit up the whole thing. That's alright, it's not blood, it's just ketchup. Alright. Yeah, there it is. It was paint the whole time. Ah. Just, just paranoia. Alright, let's see what we got for us. Aluminium and plastic. Bowl supply, corrugated. I have no idea what's going on with this thing. Man, the music just stopping whenever- Ah ha! Ah ha ha! You thought you could hide from me. It's okay. No, we're going over here. We're, we're going to fight about this. That's what we're doing today. <laughs> it's aluminium. <laughs> aluminium and plastic. None of you are aluminum <laughs> also apply materials question mark aluminium plastic digging these drums though bolt supplying thingy and the other one says something about cloning avocados need to sleep Promote heart, health, blood sugar regulation, anti-inflammatory. Why? Order longer freezer flaps. Okay. Well, let's see what we got. I'm going down another dream level. <laughs> or another dream within a dream. Enjoy avocados. Actually, you know what? This is another 5C. Oh god, I gotta hit all of them. This is like my phone alarm to try to wake me up in the morning. You know what? I'm looking at the time. It's been here for two hours. How about we call it quids for here and pick up the rest another time? This is a good stopping point. And then continue it on later. I think that's what... Oh my good lord. Yeah, let's do that. Let's call it on this one. Because I'm going to have to go off and make food anyway. And we can do more later on. Is there a save function or something? Yeah, restart level. That's close enough. Overall, not a bad game. I enjoy that one.
And we can leave you with, you know, your, um... Spooky, nice burrito nightmares. We can pick up some more next time. I'll talk to you shortly. <sighs>